Speaking to the press in Bitini Makweni County, Senator Mutula Kilonzo told the Independent Electoral and Boundaries Commission IEBC to fully use electronic registers on the voting day to avoid possible nullification of results by the court afterwards. The senator has revisited the contentious issue of identification and transmission of the August 9 poll results, advocating the electoral body to fully use technology during the exercise. In the process of those uh, pro providing for the law on the electronic transmission of results, we also provided for something we call an integrated electoral management system. The kit that is going to be used in our polling stations is supposed to recognize voters, is supposed also to record the number of voters in that polling station and at the same time enable we should be enabled to transmit election results unfortunately the country is not well covered on network and therefore while the electric, electri, electronic transmission of results is the best option possible there should be a provision where there is a failure on uh, Elect on the on the on the transmission of results, so that the returning officer can either access satellite satellite technology or technology that would enable them to transmit the results. Well, the the law that we proposed does not give an option for a person from Hola, a person from Abaswen, a person from Kakuma, a person from Lodwa to come from Lodwa to KICC on presidential elections. That is not what we wanted. We wanted a system where you, could, you can scan the results of an election and transmit them to Nairobi without manually transmitting them. But where the network is not available, the returning officer should have an opportunity of going to the closest possible place where they can transmit those results. Any manual transmission of results is going to cause us problems. And, that, and we refuse that provision. And it's called Section 44A. We refuse that provision because it has an opportunity of mischief in transmission of results. It is the sole reason why the Supreme Court nullified the 2017 presidential election.